What's up? I'm an empathetic chicken again. <laughs> yeah, I think it's like the Cancer New Moon tomorrow or today or something. It's probably different around the world, but for me, it's tomorrow. So I'm gonna just pull a couple cards for like a little uh, new moon message. Maybe something we need to be aware of. Maybe some like intentions we need to be setting. I don't know if you do that. All right, so what we need to be aware of at this time, Univoice. In a voice. All right, so we might be feeling some feelings inside, like we're having some stuff that we feel like we need to say. So maybe that needs to be the main focus. And this is kind of weird because this was my card this morning. <laughs> so I don't know if this is just for me, but it, it wants to come out. So maybe everybody's kind of going through this period of just having these thoughts and feelings that they want to speak out but they're just kind of scared of what people would think if they heard them because that's how I was feeling about my reading that I just posted I was like I don't know if anybody wants to hear this <laughs> I don't want anybody mad at me <laughs> but I'm just saying what I'm feeling inside so yeah maybe the message is just kind of pay attention to maybe what you're feeling what you're wanting to say communicate and just be okay with whatever that is and how it comes out because I know I've been like beating myself up a lot over how I speak because I have a lot of filler words <laughs> but it's because like in my reading this morning it's because I feel like I'm doing it again it's because I feel like I have to rush my thought process so if I would just give myself permission to pause and consider what's in there wanting to come out first <laughs> then I wouldn't need to just like say like 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 80,000 times <laughs> so that's another thing just be patient with yourself and whatever you're you're kind of feeling and wanting to say because it might just need some time to like incubate and, and you might need to get it out in a specific way without feeling rushed or worried about I don't know it doesn't need to be specific based on what you think someone else thinks because that was another thing I was dealing with I was like saying oh I gotta edit out all these likes because people are gonna not want to hear what I have to say but then I had to check myself and be like you know this is where I'm at right now communicating your inner knowledge your inner knowing is like a, a process it's not always going to come out perfect i mean it's it's good in here and in here uh, you know you know <laughs> it's just when we try to like bring it bring it out here is when it just doesn't sound right but it don't have to make sense to nobody else it's nice when it does but as long as you know that's what counts. Yeah, we just whole cancer, cancer vibe thing. I mean, I'm not really that knowledgeable about astrology, so I won't claim to be like <laughs> uh, knowing all that. But with this whole, like, I've always heard that cancer is kind of like the homey, the homey kind of vibes. So our inner voice comes from like our home within. That's beautiful. <laughs> so cheesy. But you know what I mean. Like it's, it's sacred. So treat it as such. Don't be beating yourself up. If you don't know how to express it. It's still in there. It's still you. You'll get there. I'll get there. We're going to get there. So yeah. New moon and cancer. Hope you have a good one. Set whatever intentions you want to do. Anyway, that's a little mini mini message for the collective for this new moon. 
and I will be back. So thanks for being here.